All right, hey guys, Aquatic Bob's here. Just a quick video tonight. Some of you guys have been asking what my par is in my tank, and I wanted to do a video just going over really briefly uh, certain sections of my tank and what par it is. And so right off the bat, if you guys watch some of my older videos, you know I run a few different lights all together. So I got two AI Hydra 32s, and in the back I have just a 24 inch T5 fixture with two blue plus bulbs, uh, just for more of that peak spectrum. Um, and then I have a Reef Bright LED strip up front, not the XHO, just the blue Atinic. Um, and then I have a Radeon XR15 Gen 4 Pro in the center. And so all these lights, you know, with the all blue strip up front and the blue T5s in the back. I mean, I'm hitting probably 75% blue and maybe 20% violet and, and UV and, and maybe 5% white. So my like my settings on the Hydra 32s and the XR15 Radeon is all blues and everything and violets are at about 80% and whites I think are at like 15%. But then when you add in the blue LED strip and the T5s, it's it's a lot of a lot of blue. And speaking of blue, my lights are all turned, uh, so no white. It's all blue and violet channels right now. A little bit of red, a little bit of green. Uh, that's why you see all this pop in, in the blue background so much. But uh, so here we go, really quick. I'm just gonna point, and this is gonna be roughly. So the top row up in the back there. You can see like the haymaker here, uh, Fruity Pebbles, Miss Piggy, uh, Circus Freak, Bioshock back there, um, the uh, Walt Disney, uh, Orange Passion, TSA's Bubble Yum Acro. This was just a, a, a acro with potential from. Uh, can't even remember the website right now. <laughs> and uh, the Aqua SD Rainbow Millie, um, Passion Fruit Acropora, Zenith Acropora, there's a purple passion back there, and then the Grave Digger. So this area down here is a little lower, it's probably around 250 to 275. But that top rock area there, and even onto this rock, and, and this whole area is really hitting 325 to 350 uh, most of the day. And then we get down into this front middle area, it's about 200 coming up to the T Top Shelf Aquatics Carolina Reaper, then the Bill Murray right there, Dan Aykroyd, just a Blue Lagoon Tenuous. Uh, that area is hitting about 225. So a little bit higher than the front center, which I really think it's about 200 the last time that I measured. And so let's get into like the frag racks on the side real quick. On this frag rack here, the back part's hitting about 150, the front part's hitting about 100. That whole rack in the top back right there is hitting about 175 to 200 on the farthest back part. And this whole area of the sand bed down here is at about a solid 125 to 130. Uh, I just added this frag rack recently, so I'm not sure, but I'm assuming that based on the middle readings of the tank here, which is about 110, and and being at about 130 over here, I'm guessing this is probably about 125 up top, maybe 150. Uh, moving over to my Euphilia garden is at about 150, strong 150. Uh, all this front area of the tank still about 110. When when the two lights intersect down here, I would say it's it's a it peaks out a little bit higher, maybe 10 extra par 120, 125. This front corner of the tank here is about 100. Uh, this frag rack up front, <laughs> my son, is getting ready for bed. And this frag rack here, I, I haven't measured it. This is a newer addition. I'm guessing that on the right side here, it's getting more light, maybe 175 to the middle, and left side is probably 125 to 150. And then this frag rack over here, further back, it's about 180, 
and this front corner here is 110. So that gives you guys a rough estimate of what my tank is. I know that was really fast. Don't have a lot of time tonight, but I did want to get this video out. And so think about your coral placement and think about what position your corals were in when you bought them, what par level they were in. If you can ask the shipper, um, I know a lot of them just get put into a frag tank where they're all under very similar par, but if you can ask what they were growing out in, what conditions, really gives you a, a helpful hint. And I know a lot of S LPS and, and SPS can change colors based on lighting and par and nutrients. And so we really want to hit peak color and also peak health. Uh, so let's try to position our corals in places that it's going to be healthy for them and optimal for growth and coloration. So LPS, most, most LPS generally, chalice coral, acans, trachees, lobos, ganis, cyphastria, blastomusa, acan bower bankies, plates, favetes, um, Chalice, uh, Duncans, yeah, a lot of these acans, more acans, even zoanthids, they're really okay. In even as low as 50, I like turning my lights up a little bit more than that. I, I would recommend 75 to 150 par for most of those. Even Euphelia, I'm, I'm starting to see, even with a little bit higher light, my cotton candy torch there, it's getting a, quite a bit of light. Yeah, the tips are probably. 175 par and it's got amazing color amazing and so I would say everything's pooping right now thanks thanks tank but I would say that um, most LPS are 75 to 150 par somewhere in that range again each coral is different each tank is different but that's a good good target range if you don't know your par please don't guess I, I made that mistake and I thought I was getting so good at it but when I got a par meter and checked and adjusted my lights it made a world of a difference I'm telling you guys like I like to think I'm a person with decent common sense and and smart fairly smart <laughs> but the par meter changed everything made it it's just so hard to tell and so you really want to get that down you want to get spectrum down um, it helps to just know uh, for sure and it's a lot more peace of mind so uh, I would say SPS there's a wide variety of SPS there's low light SPS like this stylo cosoenia I never like saying that name it's a supreme stylo let's see if I can get a little a little better angle there's a little bit better so far back but like this guy right there he's hitting about 115 par and he's blocked you know he's shaded a little bit so that's an example of a lower light uh, SPS uh, also mushrooms are in that mid-range too I know a lot of there's a lot of mushroom fans out there I am too love them uh, but acros are you know bulk reef supply says 200 to 350 is the sweet spot for most acros again every acropora is different and this guy's he's kind of like the crown of the tank Walt Disney tenuous and he is hitting you know a solid 375 and he's got some pretty amazing colors coming through on him Let's see if I can turn these off real quick. If we can get a little better top-down action, right? A little down shirt. Yeah, this one power head. Well, I guess there's two. Yeah, I got five power heads running here. Pretty crazy. Crazy stuff. Look at that. Just beautiful. So, this one somehow gets pointed up so high up. And, uh, yeah, even these anemones up front are really looking good. 
It's like a totally different world looking from the top down. Totally different. You see the back side of this uh, circus freak Acropora. It's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, so guys, stick with it. Stick with it. All good things in a reef tank take a little bit of time. And I would encourage you guys, uh, do your research. Find out what par is best for each coral you have. And try to stick to it. Make... Make your coral happy. It's just like us. The more, <laughs> the more we eat and get proper rest, we our bodies need light. Um, you know, the better we take care of ourselves, the healthier and happier we are. The better we take care of our corals, the healthier and happy our corals are as well. Sorry about my son crying. It's it's bedtime. <laughs> He doesn't know it, but his rest is going to make him healthier. So thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate you all. Please subscribe. Please share the video. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment. Give me some video ideas, and I would greatly appreciate it. So look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Aquatic Bob's out.